2015. Leaves his mark on his hometown and on the 2015 championship. 2015 was a, a great year and massively relieved, you know, it's starting to, to really sink in and, and to see number one on the window and and uh, and the car and everything is starting to become real. So pretty serious now to try and defend it because I don't want to lose it. There's always doubt, I guess, in your mind that uh, after 12 years of trying, is it ever gonna is it ever gonna happen? We've finished second a couple of times. We've finished third a hell of a lot of times. You always have belief. You always think the team can do it. You think you can do it. But for some reason, 12 years in a row, it hasn't happened. But the hunger's always been there. The motivation's always been there. And finally, the, the results show that uh, you know hard work and persistence and patience, it, it pays off. What I learnt last year and did really well was manage the, the rounds that I couldn't win. You know, years gone by, I would have pushed the car further than it needed to go, and that often results in um, slapping the fence or, uh, or locking a tyre or, or making a mistake. Where last year it was about, okay, car's good, let's win. Car's not 100%, let's survive, and that um, strategy worked well. So, fingers crossed, 2016, we've got a a good car and when it's on I'm going to push for wins and if we can beat nine race wins then uh, we're going to be in good form, it's, um, it's going to be hard to beat. Well there's always threats, I guess you, you look at, um, you have to look at Triple Eight, there's no hiding the fact that if you beat Triple Eight you would have won seven of the last seven championships so you know Win Cup um, has lost number one for the first time in a long time so he will be more motivated than ever. You've got the Gears who comes in and he's expected to do big things now, but pressure's on him. He's in a good car at a good team, so he will step up to what level him and Wing Cup. It's going to be interesting to watch. Will Davis is in a new car, Fabian Coulthard's in a new car, HRT have dropped back to two, Volvo's inherited new guys. It's probably the hardest year we've ever seen in, in V8 supercar history, I believe, so it's going to be a tough year. I've worked my backside off my whole life to get number one. I finally got it, I don't want to lose it, so that's a massive motivator. My two boys, when they are pretty proud, I go to kinder and they tell their friends that the dad's the champion, so I want to keep street cred down at the kindergarten because that's worth a bit. Yeah, I don't think there's more pressure or anything to perform, so um, I actually feel free. I feel like the monkey's off the back, I feel, I feel light. I'm energetic, I feel like I want to go racing and uh, I don't feel like, I'd, like I've got anything to prove but I feel like I'm ready to race and that's, uh, that's a pretty good feeling.